this has just been my application that uh, is adding Dropbox support. Um, I'm registered as a, a pro user, um, which will add Dropbox support. At the moment, if you make any changes to this this file, um, nothing happens basically. Or nothing. It's saved online, but there's nothing um, uh, uh, downloaded available offline. Um, and this is the the Dropbox directory that will end up in. So I can go ahead and go into my account, update my profile, link to Dropbox. Okay, so I've already logged into Dropbox. Now it says that um, uh, it's linked to Dropbox, and basically anything I create in JSBin will now be automatically saved to to my Dropbox. So if I make a change here, um, cleared. Uh, maybe this is. Now clear, and then there's a short period of time. I think it's 30 seconds debounce. Make sure we're not kind of constantly sending the Dropbox. And once that that save settles, it'll be sent upstream to to Dropbox, which you should see uh, coming down now. So if I go into this directory, there goes the file. Um, if you click on it, I should be able to see the actual output. Um, download that. And there you go, I guess you're blocking JavaScript. But the actual file is in my Dropbox directory. This is the file, and I have offline access. And in future, we are intending to add um, webhook support so we can see any changes that the user made on their Dropbox directory. And we'll sync that back up with our, our database as well so the user gets kind of a, a full sync between JSBin and Dropbox using the Dropbox integration. Okay, so any other questions, please um, send me an email on the, uh, the account. Thanks a lot.